right guys, so we have a fun video for you. And we have a, a very unique and just cool opportunity to be working with Insta360. We get to use their new Insta360 Go 3 for the very first time. Honestly, like this camera right here is the most simple vlogging camera I think we've ever used. And it just makes, it makes vlogging, handing over the camera to the kids just fun and unique. I'll just run over a few of the features, show you what comes in the box, and then how we, as a family, because we vlog a lot, in the box. And here is the Insta360 Go 3. It looks completely different than the Go 2. The go-to looked similar to like AirPods. Cool thing about this one, it now has a flip up screen. This main unit right here is called the Action Pod. So the things that come in the box with the new Insta360 Go 3, uh, you got a completely different look. Uh, the outside body of this is called the Action Pod. And so the Go 3 actually clips into this with a magnet. You can hear it click clips in and then there's a little lock so you can push the button in to pull it out. The cool thing about the action pod, it's got a flip up screen. It's great for vlogging because you can see where your camera angle is and make sure that you're in frame. Whenever you're in the action pod, you have extended battery life. So some more things that come in this box. You have the pivot stand. The cool thing about the pivot stand, it's got a reusable sticky pad on here so you can stick it to just about anything. And then to reactivate, all you gotta do is wipe it with a, a wet rag. And then this pivots, and this can either lock onto the action, action pod, and it locks in. And then you can put, press the buttons in, and it unlocks. Or you can actually use just the Go 3, and then it clips right in, and then it's locked on. One other feature of the pivot stand, you can unscrew it and it's got a quarter 20 female. And so you can use it with different accessories like here, here's the monkey tail. And this is what, this is one thing that we used a lot while we were at the water park and doing different things because I could wrap it around the girl's arm. They could hold, hold on to the monkey tail and I could wrap it around their arm to where they can't drop the camera. And so they get to hold on and get some POV shots. And I got some cool shots of that. What was some other things that y'all got to do with the camera? Um, we would put this around us. Then we would put it under here. Yeah. Then, um. So, so this right here is the magnetic necklace pendant. And so you can wear it around your neck, put it underneath your clothing so you can conceal the camera. And so whenever you put it under your clothing, it just snaps right to the Go 3. And so you get some really cool POV shots with that. There's some new shooting modes. In the Go 2, it was called Pro Video. In the Go 3, it's now called Freeform Video, where you can reframe and uh, change your different aspect ratio shots. You can change your different shots, whether it's like a, a linear view, an ultra wide or a wide shot, all with just one shooting mode. And so whenever you hook it up to the Insta360 app, you can go back and you can reframe it. This is another accessory that comes in the box. This is the easy clip. And so this can clip onto just about anything. It's got like a little a little clip on the top with a pivot and the Go 3 just locks into here like this into the easy clip and you can clip it onto your hat. This is the quick release mount. And so the cool thing about this one, this one has a quarter 20 female so that you can screw it on to any of the normal Insta360 invisible selfie sticks or other selfie sticks. It can just screw on. Also, it's got flip out action camera mounts. So you can actually mount it to like any GoPro accessory. The Insta360 just clips into it and you just press firmly and it's locked into place. This is the mini two-in-one tripod right here. And so you got a little extended tripod and then this can mount right onto here. Obviously we use this a lot whenever we're vlogging. You just put the Go3 Go in like that, flip it up, and you're vlogging right away. 
this lens right here is this protective lens unscrew so if anything ever happens to it you can screw it off and screw a new one right back on so the go 3 weighs in at only 35 grams it's the world's smallest action camera which makes it super easy for vlogging for just carrying around with you and being inconspicuous so it doesn't look like you're vlogging you don't get a lot of attention from other people around you this is so easy to carry around like you don't even have to have this with you even a couple times like we were in the pool and i just would put it in my mouth like it. and i'm doing different things with the girls i have it in my mouth and it's just super easy to hold there's so many different options that you have just to hold this the pendant gives you hands-free pov action we use this a lot whenever we're with the girls they uh they can just clip it right onto their chest and they can do whatever they're doing and you just get a really cool unique camera angle that you don't normally get there's chest mounts for other action cameras but it's just it's bulky it's you know just it's constrictive and it's it's hard to use that's why I mean, honestly, that that is why we think this Insta360 GO 3 is the best camera hands down for family vloggers, just because it's so easy to hold, it's so easy to carry around. There's so many different variations and ways that you can hold this camera. You got to see the world from their point of view, which was super neat. And one really awesome way that we use this, and whenever we clip it to the girls or whenever they're holding it, sometimes, they just get caught up in the moment whenever they're vlogging and it just they just record and record and record. That's what they're known for. The cool thing about this, this acts as a wireless remote for the Go 3. Me or Danielle can have this as a live preview of exactly what is going through this lens. And so we can actually see what the girls are shooting and we can start and stop recording, which is super neat. So the camera has flow state stabilization. And so no matter what the girls are doing, if they're like running around or turning upside down or moving the camera, it, the horizon stays perfectly level and locked no matter what they do. I mean, with kids, like they don't quite have to pay attention to making sure the camera is perfectly still and level. The camera works for you. The Go 3 is waterproof down to 16 feet. Perfect for whenever we took it to the water park, whenever we go swimming with it. Any pool that we're in, we're not... It's not deeper than 16 feet, so we can take it pretty much anywhere we want to go. The Action Pod is IPX4 rated, so it's rated against splashes and stuff like that, but it's not fully submersible. So the Go 3 has upgraded audio. There's a microphone on the top and on the front. You get a lot better audio quality whenever you're vlogging and talking to the camera. There's microphones on the top and the front, so no matter like if it's on your chest, out in front, you're talking to somebody, you're always gonna get clear audio. It's in three different price points and it starts at $379.99. The 64 gig is $399.99 and the 128 is $429.99. One last cool thing with shooting with the girls, it has AI auto editing. Through the Insta360 app, you can actually select your clips and it will put together a video for you. Now that we've given the full rundown of this Insta360 GO 3, we just thoroughly enjoyed using this camera. Thank you Insta360 for sending this and partnering with us and our family. And I'm gonna stitch together a little video of the girls actually using this camera and over some clips that we took this past weekend at New Brunfels. And we're gonna make some little videos that the girls shot whenever they got to use the camera. So follow the link in the description and get your Insta360 GO 3. Watch the video.
go inside and see what's. You guys say what you're doing. Oh, yeah. To you. It's kind of like a rubber band. <laughs> so it's two two bones that are connected. Let's give him that tongue. Why does it smell? You have to ask him. Why do you make me touch that? You didn't make me touch it. I'm watching. That's what's reporting on that. Here, so I have to abandon this. Yeah, that's kind of dumb. I promise these guys are not dumb. They're weird. <laughs> like we can see what she's doing. Nope. Taylor, help me. All right, you'll get a turn next. All right, come on out here. Taylor. I know they are. You toss it in, toss the hole in his mouth open for you. Put your back. Do it. Cause I.